Hello students, welcome to the channel Top Gate. In this video, I will discuss three more problems of DFA. That is, to design a DFA that accepts any string of 0, 1 with 0 being exactly 2, at least 2 and at most 2. That is, number of 0 in W, W is a string. So, number of 0 in a string should be exactly 2. Number of 0 in a string should be greater than or equal to 2 that is at least 2 number of 0 in a string should be less than or equal to that is at most 2 uh, so we'll design a dfa for all these three cases okay so let's start with the first one that is the number of 0 in a string is 2 okay so if we talk about this one then in this one what is the minimum possible string so what we have in sigma in sigma we have 0 and 1 that is all the strings will be made up of zeros and ones only and it is saying that the number of zeros in the string should be exactly 2 ok so what should I get in this one I should get any string like uh, the minimum string in this case should be 0 0 that is exactly two zeros are there now after the 0 0 0 1 should be there or 1 0 0 should be there or 1 1 0 0 should be there or 0 1 0 should be there or anything so any string can be accepted in this one of any length but the number of zeros should be exactly two that is our main concern okay so let's design the dfa for this one okay so what we do we start from the minimum string so we make the dfa we design the dfa for the minimum string and then we'll incorporate all the other cases in that okay so let's start doing the first one that is the minimum string in this case will be 00, zero. so let's design a dfa for the 00, zero first okay so let's start with initial state that is q naught okay so at q naught if we have to accept 00, zero then 0 is applied go on to state q1 and again 0 applied go on to state q2 and make it as final now at this point at q0 the number of zeros will be 0 only till this point number of zeros are 1 till this point number of zeros are 2 so this is your final state so 0 0 is accepted now the condition of, DF, of dfa is it should have exactly one path for every input alphabet so we have one also therefore i'll put a self loop here that is 1 again i'll put a self loop here that is 1 and at this point i'll put a self loop here of 1 okay but 0 is still missing because we have to add a path for 0 also in this case so if i add 0 for on this self loop here then it will start accepting the strings having zeros more than 2 also okay so what i'll do i'll simply go on to state q3 and i'll not make it as final with the input 0 and here i'll add a self loop of 0 comma 1 that is anything i can add here no issues okay so this dfa will accept all the strings in which the number of zeros is exactly 2 so 0 0 will be accepted 1 0 1 0 will be accepted 1 0 1 0 1 1 1 1 will be accepted but 0 0 0 will not be accepted because the 0 0 0 it has three zeros in it so therefore it should not be accepted so this is a dfa for the first case now second case second case is number of zeros should be at least two okay so it should be at least two not not uh, less than two but it can be more than two also okay so let's start doing this one also q naught is an initial state and in this case also the minimum string should be 0 0 that is it should be at least 0 0 so minimum string in this case will be 0 q1 and again 0 that is q2 and make it as final okay so 0 0 will be accepted in this machine okay now again i have to add the pass for other alphabets also that is i add a path for 1 again add a path for 1 now at this point also i'll again add a path for one okay now zero is left it is saying that it should accept all the strings in which the number of zeros is at least two it can be two also it can be three also it can be four also but it should not be less than two so what i'll do i'll simply add a self loop of zero here okay so it will start accepting all the strings that is having number of zeros as two or three or four or five so it will accept 
zero zero then zero one zero one zero 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 and so on so any number of zeros will be accepted at q2 so this is the dfa for case number two now case number three that is we should design a dfa which should accept all strings of 0 comma 1 in which the number of zeros should be at most 2 it should not be more than 2 okay so what i'll do uh, if it is at most 2 that means it can be 0 also it can be 1 also it can be 2 also okay so but it should not be more than 2 so i'll start with state q0 and i'll make it as final and then q1 again make it as final then q2 again make it as final this will be 0 this will be 0 then add 1 here add 1 here add 1 here okay so minimum string in this case will be 0 only that is at q0 nothing should be accepted so epsilon can be accepted at q0 that is number of zeros is 0 at q0 number of zeros uh, till q1 will be 1 only number of zeros till q2 will be 2 only now it should not accept any string in which number of zeros is more than 2 so at q2 now i need a path for 0 also okay but i cannot add the path here why because it, if i add it here then it will start accepting the strings in which number of zeros becomes more than 2 so what i'll do i'll simply go on to some other state and i will not make it as final and on this one i'll add 0 comma 1 so it will start accepting all the strings in which number of zeros is at most 2 it will accept uh, number of zeros as 0 number of zeros as 1 number of zeros as 2 but it will not accept uh, the strings in which number of zeros is more than 2 in this case okay so these are the three cases for uh, exactly 2 at least 2 and at most 2 that is all thank you so much